Good evening. Thank you for joining us for the news at 10. I'm Richard Gearhart. And I'm Karina Corral. The new Paso Robles Joint Unified School District Board is beginning to pick up the pieces after Superintendent Chris Williams resigned and the budget fell more than $2 million short. KSBY's Megan Healy is live in Paso Robles outside the district office with what happened during tonight's discussion. Megan. Good evening, Richard and Karina. Right off the bat, the Slow County Superintendent addressed the elephant in the room, which is that the board will need to put their differences aside in order to overcome some hurdles. Now, the biggest hurdle they're facing is a budget deficit, and it will be met with budget cuts. The board appointed Slow County Superintendent Dr. James Brescia as the temporary chairperson, but they still need to look for an interim superintendent. One audience member recommended that current trustee Jennifer Gaviola would be a good fit. Because somebody from the outside is not going to know they're going to have to start down here. She's starting up here. The board unanimously approved a resolution to acknowledge the need for long term cuts. Apologizing in advance for what we are about to do be painful for all of us, but it has to be done. Board members say they will try their best to keep cuts away from the classroom, but they will need to sever about $800,000 each year. Brescia went over some housekeeping rules too, saying it's time to put animosity aside. We have to own that. It's okay. But we have to behave respectfully. He addressed the three recent resignations, saying the contracts will be reviewed by council, but that was all he could allude to. One man hopes the board can come together. They're still bleeding money. And so I don't know if they'll be able to do that or what they can do to turn it around. It has to be turned around some point in time. If the board does nothing to remedy the deficit, the budget will drop into negative reserve levels over the next couple of years. Live in Paso Robles, Megan Healy, KSBY News. Megan, thank you. Chris Williams resigned last week. He had faced scrutiny for mismanaging the district's budget, which was $2.1 million less than what was projected for this school year.